the truth about Bidenomics. Joe Biden is trying to coin the phrase Bidenomics to describe what I can only imagine as a parallel universe where he believes the U.S. economy is thriving thanks to his economic policies. Unfortunately for us all, the reality doesn't match his perception. Both on Twitter and during a speech in Chicago, Biden repeatedly touted Bidenomics as he attempts to sell Americans on his economic record. For example, in one tweet, he or his handlers wrote, We've added over 13 million jobs, more jobs in two years than any president has added in a four-year term, and that's no accident, that's Bidenomics. While technically true, most of these jobs were due to post-pandemic return to office not newly created jobs. The entire Bidenomics shtick is built on lies and misdirection. Here are five facts that expose Bidenomics. Rampant inflation. The U.S. has had 4% or higher inflation for 26 straight months under Joe Biden, peaking at 9.1% in June 2022. In the four years prior, it averaged roughly 2% over regulation. The regulations that Biden has put on the American economy have cost Americans roughly $10,000 per household. Credit card debt. Americans have roughly $1 trillion in credit card debt, a $250 billion increase since Biden took office. Gas prices. Joe Biden handed Americans a new record high national average of $5.01 last summer. And while it's now down to $3.54, that's still considerably higher than the $2.37 average when Trump left office. Declining wages. Real average hourly earnings have fallen 3.16% during Biden's presidency, according to the Bureau of Labor Statistics. And the American public knows that Bidenomics is BS. A recent Fox News poll found that just 20% of Americans say Biden's economic policies are helping them. What do you think? I sure hope people come out to the primary in March of 2024 in North Carolina, but if Peter Boykin is elected lieutenant governor of North Carolina, he will be a thorn in my side. Just what I need another Republican that calls me out on my BS. Just great. Hi folks, this is Peter Boykin and... Thank you for going right with Peter Boykin. I am running for North Carolina lieutenant governor. Now I think it's time for us to go right. Bidenomics, 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 Bidenomics.